Hey guys, my name is Evan, and today I'll be reviewing my Lego Infinite Achilles. So, I have made the Infinite Achilles with the working Infinite Achilles gimmick. Now, before we go over any of this gimmicky stuff, we'll just go straight to the chip here, which is called Achilles. I have seen other people do this kind of gimmick and stuff, but I want to make this video kind of short, or try to make it short at least, because um, uh, I kind of have a lot to talk about. So, here's the layer base, which is infinite. Looks pretty cool, has the straight swords and all. Very nice. And we have this chassis here, which is called, I think it's called 1B, I think. Yeah, 1B. And the reason why it's not how I normally make it, sorry, I shook the camera, but yeah, the reason why it's not how I normally make it is because with the armor, the bay looks pretty chunky, so I just made it a two-part chassis. And then the driver's dimension dash. So you've already seen this um, from Lord Spriggan. You have stamina mode, attack mode. And then a even taller attack book. Like that. So, yeah, this is Dimension. Dimension Dash. And I just realized that now, but I'm supposed to have three studs. I only have three studs when it's a Dimension Driver. Um, instead of just two studs for a regular driver. But here's what the Beyblade looks like without the armor. Probably the size of maybe like a Chosey Beyblade or something. But... When you add on the armor, which I'm assuming is going to be called the infinite armor. I'm just going to call it um, that for now. But, yeah, so this is actually not my design. This is from Minor Boy K2's Revive Phoenix armor design. But I'm repurposing it, and I did some design tweaks. So I made it one stud um, uh, shorter. So it's um, two studs tall. I have two stud connections here, and I have these flat... L-shaped pieces on the sides and it looks pretty cool so how you attach this armor onto the Beyblade you take these two blue parts and insert them into those parts right there so push that and you have your armored Achilles kind of like the Big Bang armor it looks pretty cool and you don't technically need your chip in there for it to work here so here's what the layer looks like without the chip and all Looks pretty cool, and yeah, so you can put your chip, you can put in your chip first or second, doesn't really matter. But yeah, so here is what Infinite Achilles looks like. So yeah, tell me what you think about this gimmick, um, yeah, I think it's pretty cool. And so yeah, thank you guys for watching this video, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!